What's going on, Jerome's? The Minnesota Fighting Vikings. Yeah, there's still football to be played. They made a fistful of transactions on Tuesday, and we're going to run uh, through a couple of them. Most of them are COVID-related, so whatever. Uh, Nick Candlelight Vigil is off the reserve COVID-19 list, and since Zimmer said he's going to play the starters, Vigil is probably going to start with Kendricks and Barr at linebacker against the Bears. Because, yeah, God forbid we don't find out what we have in Nick Vigil because we already know what we got. He might not even be back next year. But, yeah, God forbid Blake Lynch or Chaz Surratt get a little bit of run. Or even Troy Dye. But, hmm. Uh, Chris Herndon has been placed on the reserve COVID-19 list. He's probably going to miss Sunday's game. Uh, he's missed most of the season because he hasn't really been on the field. And, yeah, I I'm a big Rick Spielman apologist. But, yeah, the Herndon trade was a bit of a swing in the miss. And, yeah, it's not as bad as you thought. You did. Uh, again, the Vikings did not give up a fourth round pick for Herndon. They gave up a fourth for Herndon and a sixth. So Chris Herndon was the difference between a fourth and a sixth rounder. So that's, that's whatever. Like uh, a mid fourth and a high sixth rounder, by the way, because it's with the Jets. So that's whatever there. Just didn't pan out. There was a little bit of scrambling, a little bit of gambling uh, after Irfsman Jr. went out with that. Um, what what do you have? Microfracture? No, meniscus. Yeah, got. I'm glad it's not microfracture because that one could be dicey. And he didn't know that Gronklin was going to step up great as tight end, too. And I guess he didn't have faith in Zach Davidson or Brandon Dillon. So, yeah, whatever. Uh, Perry Nickerson uh, on the practice squad, and he's been on the practice squad uh, COVID reserve 19. So, yeah, whatever there. And they also signed an interior offensive lineman named Cole Banwart. Which is a great name, man. Uh, he's been signed to the practice squad. Uh, ben Ward is, uh, was a 2021 UDFA out of the University of Iowa. And yes, he can play guard. Here's Dan Brugler's uh, write-up of him. Barnard was a four-year letterman and offensive defensive lines at Highland High School. Earned first team All-State, blah, 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 went to Iowa. Missed mo After working himself into the starting rotation, Ben Ward missed most of the 2019 season due to a knee injury, but returned healthy in 2020 and had his best season as a senior, playing both guard spots. He uses quick, choppy steps to mirror in confined spaces. Same. Uh, showing enough natural strength to weather the momentum of bull rushers. Ben Wart locates blitzes from distance and looks to control defenders with his hands. In my hands again. He doesn't have ideal body control as a puller. That's what she said. Uh, or on the second level, and must improve his blocking angles in the run game. But other than that, he's fantastic. Uh, overall, ba Ben Wart doesn't have overwhelming traits, but he is an aware, disciplined blocker with the banger mentality to finish through the whistle grade priority free agent. And, hey, he played with Tyler Linderbaum, so maybe that's it. That That's how the Vikings are going to draft him. So uh, it's cool. Uh, it's whatever. It, it's a, a late season signing to the practice squad. They may give Ben Wart a futures contract. He'll, he'll be in practice for a couple days. I don't see him playing on, on Sunday since, you, you know, uh, all, but although... Zimmer would play Banwart ahead of Wyatt Davis. I don't know, but I don't know. Maybe it turns on something next year on the new, under the new regime. So we'll see there. But uh, that's it. Uh, that's a look at the Vikings Tuesday transactions. What are your thoughts and our thoughts? Let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support that work? Put a little something in the Venmo. But until next time, Skull Production Value.